Good morning! This is the first morning, well, it's technically the second morning since I came back home to Australia. Yesterday was so not productive, I should say, because I had this thing happening with me called jet lag. <laughs> <laughs> it's not fun. I actually crashed at 11 in the morning till 5 p.m. Which wasn't a plan. Yeah, so I haven't really done anything proper yesterday. And today I'm full of... not energy, I'm still kind of low. Probably full of motivation to do stuff and just go back to my routine. I wish I would go back to the gym today, but again, the energy levels are not there. It's not happening. <laughs> I didn't even bother to fix my hair because I don't really want to. But I do have a couple things I want to do today and I thought I'm gonna bring you with me. You ready to go? What? Yes? You ready to go? <laughs> Let's go! Yes! Come on! <laughs> Morning! Could I please get decaf cappuccino regular size? Thank you. Me. Sit. Wait. Go. <laughs> it's actually chillier than I thought it's gonna be. It says it's 16 degrees, but it's kind of freezing actually. Miss, miss. Miss? You know, funny thing that decaf actually tastes good compared with all Lithuanian coffee. I mean, you have no idea how bad it was. Every coffee I tried back home was not drinkable, I should say, compared with Australian coffee. And everybody knows that Australia has the best coffee, so, you know, I'm just comparing two different things. But yeah, I had one coffee with a friend, actually, that lives in Australia so she knows how coffee is supposed to taste she was on a holiday as well and she was just driving through my city and we thought we're just gonna have coffee together um, and I took her to the local coffee shop which my little sister said don't take iced coffee there because it's really shit I forgot about it <laughs> and it got really hot so we thought we're just gonna get iced coffee iced latte that's all we wanted and they said, oh, we don't actually have just ice latte. We can make ice latte with caramel, mint, and vanilla or whatever options were. My friend actually came with her Australian partner. So yeah, he knows coffee as well. <laughs> we ordered coffee and I said, why can't we just make it ice latte without any sugar, without any syrup? And he said, oh, we just can't make it. That's coffee we have. We just ordered that. I got ice latte with mint, I think. They got different ones my friend's partner throw away the drink the drink a second he tried it <laughs> i think i sipped it for like maybe halfway through till my belly started hurting because all it was just cold milk with syrup so you couldn't taste any coffee like at all it was definitely a waste and the price for coffee yeah it's it's crazy you know how australia people think that coffee is expensive five dollars it's quite a lot actually but imagine paying five euros which is like seven dollars i think and when people are not getting paid a lot at all yeah there's just a bit of a disappointment in uh, my own country <laughs> we can't do coffee so decaf actually tastes like coffee now <laughs> we're just gonna make a little trip to bunnings i have this whole idea I got jealous of my mom having this huge garden and you can just go there anytime you want and pick whatever you want and eat it and have it for salad for like I got jealous okay so I'll make my own little garden in our balcony which that's my only option because we're living in rental and apartment so I have to work with what I have Miss! Come here! Come here! Come on! Hey, hey! Sit! Miss! Sit! <laughs> Good boy! Good boy! 
Good boy. Let's go. See? You're fine. <laughs> Miss Miss. <laughs> oh, buddy. Can you relax? Yep. Good boy. Oh, you're such a good boy. Yes. Yes. Moose, don't eat it. Would you like a treat? Oh my goodness, yes, you would like a treat. This? Yeah. Here you go. Good boy. We just came back from Bunnings and to be honest, it's almost 11 o'clock. It's almost um, crash time and I'm feeling it. Oh, I just, I just want to go and lay down, but I know if I'm going to sleep, I'm just gonna end up doing the same thing I did yesterday. Last night I woke up at 3 a.m. and I couldn't just fall asleep anymore. So I feel like that's why I'm so tired again. <sighs> I'm just gonna push it through. I'm gonna go and make some lunch. Yeah, yeah. I just probably need to do something and try and stay awake. <laughs> I took actually a decent amount of time to cook. My roast is still roasting <laughs> and I'm too hungry to wait for it. So I thought I'm just gonna eat it with fresh vegetables I have. You can actually go and put together my garden, if you can call it like that. I already opened the box and I'm actually really surprised what are you getting for $20. It's definitely worth the money. And even comes with like wearing system. 
but then um <clears throat> you have to have like the actual water system in the place you're putting this so i don't really have wiring system in the balcony so that is not happening do i actually have to drill the thingy into the wall i wasn't planning drilling that into the wall because it's rental but i have a spot where i could actually drill this and it would be fine because it's our old furniture that it's kind of trash already but i'm just thinking i might be able to just somehow put it together without drilling <sighs> i'll see how i go yeah and originally i thought about getting different thing well originally i thought about it this morning when i woke up at 3 a.m but i found bigger versions of this one from bunnings for like i'll put the photo of it what i mean uh that one was 89 dollars and then i found really similar thing on kmart for like 50 45 but i kind of feel like kmart it looks nicer but it's probably the quality wouldn't be the best and yeah i end up just getting this because i don't really need that big of a garden thingy because well that's really all i need i plan it i did plan everything so i think i have ideal amount of space here what is it What is this news? What is happening? Do you mind moving? <laughs> I love you. You so do. Okay, so I'm trying to pretend I know what I'm doing. result uh they looks kind of sad but <laughs> we'll see maybe it will be better in a couple of days time hopefully so what i did i took these stick on hooks and put this little rope i'm not sure if it will hold but it looks decent I like the location. I actually decided to change that up because sun goes that way in the morning. So it's not like really direct light because we have this. I reckon it's the perfect location. We have five of them now. I don't think they're all gonna survive actually. But yeah, it's all right. That is gonna be all for today because all I wanna do is just fall asleep it's four o'clock it's a bit early so i'm just gonna put a movie on and try not to fall asleep 
I have to work tomorrow actually. I'm not really keen for that. Anyways, I'll see you next time. Bye.